DevOps is not some kind of technology which you can go ahead and learn. DevOps is collection of a lot of principles and a way of working with multiple technologies in order to make sure whatever the business need of that particular organization is met. That is usually software needs and the way software gets released to the production level. Now, when we say that DevOps is all about releasing one program or one application from the development to the production and making sure everything in between works fine, then what is the future of DevOps that when all these technologies like chat GPT and lots of automation and all the other things come, sir, you might be wondering. So also you might have some fear like uh, should I go and learn DevOps when all these emerging technologies like AI and all getting popular uh, and also there are some people who are like uh, will I lose my DevOps job uh, because of this AI and uh, other coding related emergence which is happening in 2023. The thing is all the technologies which are like AI and uh, machine learning programs all those things uh, always will require one DevOps related personnel to make sure that particular technology exists and it is working fine. Because even though this AI and all looks like it is some kind of very big technologies, but in the end, they are set of programs and they are set of data. And from where do these things get data? These things get data from customer interaction only. So when customer interaction happens to one particular program, who is responsible for making sure that particular interaction works fine and whatever the developer is doing in the back end, make sure that it goes to the customer, it gets deployed on that particular website or something like that. Who is going to be responsible for that? The responsible personnel is DevOps. So you don't have to worry that all these things will take your job or there won't be any kind of job or something like that. As long as they are going to use softwares and somebody quotes that software, then obviously Obviously, there will be DevOps and they are going to make sure that all these technologies are available to the customers properly and whenever people comes to use that particular technology, they'll be able to use it. This is the responsibility of DevOps. So you don't have to worry about any kind of futuristic technology is going to replace the DevOps because DevOps is not some kind of technology which should be replaced. And if I speak properly, it is not even a technology. It's the way of using those technology in combination with the, the code and all the other things because of that uh, devops is not some kind of technology which gets outdated whenever these new technologies uh, get emerged and as long as businesses use websites and all the other technologies in order to make sure their business runs uh, until then devops is going to exist uh, and uh, your job is safe uh, and secure as long as you learn new new technologies that is required in order to make sure this chat gpt and all the other related technologies works fine uh, then DevOps is going to exist. Now the thing is, how do you keep up with all these futuristic technologies which are like coming out nowadays? The thing is, all these new technologies, we use the code only. So when there is some kind of code, your job is to release that particular code into production level and making sure that particular deployment works fine. So obviously, you have to do those things even if all these new technologies emerges. Your job is to just do these things only. That is deployment of all these technologies online. So because of that, learning basics comes very important. If you don't know the basics, then obviously when these new technologies comes out, you won't be able to use them and make sure they get released. So because of that, you should always learn the basics in the DevOps. Then you should proceed into all the other technologies which might have some kind of hype for a few years. So as these new technologies emerges, you should know how to use them and in order to use them, that time you need to know all the basics of these deployments, uh, pipeline uh, and maybe there are some docker related technologies and uh, all the other things which comes with DevOps. There are so many of them uh, but uh, you don't have to learn everything. You just have to learn whatever is required whenever you are working on some kind of project. So start from basics uh, that is releasing one simple website uh, online uh, and make sure whenever that code gets updated, website also gets updated uh, in the production level. 
so learning this simple things uh, is going to give you so much confidence uh, that okay you can get into devops uh, so i wish you best of luck uh, and uh, as new technologies emerges uh, you are ready and uh, you will be there uh, to manage all these technologies uh, and uh, make sure uh, these technologies works fine in the production level server so that's it for this video guys and if you want to see more videos like this uh, check out my channel and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and see you in the next video bye bye